In this video, I'm going to show you how you can dynamically assign tasks to your team members. Now this becomes very handy if you have several people filling the same role. For example, you might have several salespeople or you might have several support people, which means you will have a different salesperson or a different support person working this task based on the type of product that you're selling or the type of customer that you may have signed up. Now there are two parts to this video. One is going to be to show you how to create a task with a dynamic assignment, and the other is to show you how to add people automatically to specific roles. So the first thing we'll do is look at how you add a task with a dynamic assignment. So we'll first come down to Manage Sales Path, and we'll add a task to this point on the Sales Path. And this is the key to the assignment. You'll notice that when you have the option to assign people to this task, you have primary, technical, support, and then down below, you have the names of the people on your team. If you want to do an absolute assignment, in other words, if I want to ensure that Sally Martin is assigned this task, I would simply make sure that her name is selected in the dropdown. On the other hand, if I want to make this a dynamically assigned task, I would simply assign this to either primary, technical, or support. Now when a person is added to your CRM and then a person from your team is assigned as the primary person or the technical person or the support person, they would dynamically be assigned to complete this task for this particular customer. And now I'll show you multiple ways that you can assign specific people from your team to the different roles within your CRM. One way is to come into Customer Management, select a customer, and come over to this section and simply assign the person manually. And now you can simply use the drop-down windows to assign the people to their specific role for this customer. Hit Submit, and you're done. You'll see they pop up here. So now when that task is assigned, you can see that it's going to be assigned to the primary person who happens to be Billy Bob for this customer. You can also assign roles when you add customers manually. Simply come over to Add Customer, and we'll fill in the necessary information. And now you can see over in this section, you can assign roles and funnels and tags. So again, I'm going to select a person from the drop-down window. And now I've made my role assignments. Now all I have to do is hit Enter, and this person will be added to my CRM, and my team will have their assigned roles. And here's a handy tip for those of you that typically assign the same people to the same roles. After selecting your team and assigning them to their specific role, all you have to do is click this link here, Set as Default, and now, whenever someone is added to your CRM, this will be the default team that gets assigned to each customer added. Now, there may be some instances where you choose not to have this set as the default. So all you have to do is come up here and say, Clear Roles and Tags, or you can simply manually change it through the drop-down window. You can also set defaults for funnels. All you do is select the funnel and the sales path, and again, you'll set it as a default. And when people are added to your CRM, by default, they will have these funnels, sales paths, tags, and roles assigned to them. <laughs> 